And my friend turns to me and says, holy shit, that's Patrick Stickles behind the board, who is this front man of this band called Titus Andronicus, <laughs> who we were kind of like really upset, like this punk rock band from New Jersey. So it made perfect sense that Patrick Stickles was behind the board. And at the time, you guys had the likeness. It was, it was uncanny with the beard, basically. And then he oh, shaved gosh. off the beard, and we say, He did. Yeah, he shaved off the beard. I don't think your beard that ever night? Been, that, that night? That night. He wasn't here. It was you! Oh. That's the and story. That's know. the story. <laughs> and and uh, it wasn't until I met you that I go, God damn it, that wasn't Patrick Stickles. But I still love to think to this day that I was introduced by one of my punk rock icons at the open mic, but... Instead, it was one of my anti-folk icons, Dan yeah. Costello, ladies and gentlemen! Yeah. Hey, thanks. Hey, guys. Thanks. Hey, uh, Peter, that was excellent. Much appreciated. And, um, and it's nice to be here. Um, and I know... Uh, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> uh, can you make sure that my top... Because I'm not going to sing particularly loud tonight. Uh, thanks. Um... I got a new guitar, and we don't really know each other very well, so we're going to start um, getting to know each other in front of you, which if you've ever gone on a first date in a group environment, you know how awkward that can be. <laughs> with all my friends but they weren't with me I started asking them questions they wouldn't tell me the answers I thought if this is a dream well I'd rather just sleep I'd rather just sleep just sleep I started dreaming again I was up in Alaska I was with all my friends but they weren't with me I started giving the answers they wouldn't tell me the questions Thought if this is a dream, well then I'd rather just sleep. I'd rather just sleep. I'd rather just sleep. I'd rather just sleep. I'd rather just Salvador Dali Salmon fishing with Salvador Dali He was a bear I started dreaming again And I was living in Brooklyn And I was with all my friends, but they weren't, they weren't, weren't with me. I started picking the answers. They wouldn't drop off the questions. I thought, if this, if this, if this is a dream, well then I'd rather just, rather just sleep. I'd rather just sleep. I'd rather just sleep I'd rather just All I think about is work and time And now it's time to work All I think about is work and time And now it's time I started dreaming again in New Jersey and I was with all my friends but they weren't with me I started asking 
asking questions They wouldn't tell me the answers I thought if this is a dream Well then I'd rather just sleep I'd rather just sleep I will stand on the platform in a necktie. I will wander through Wall Street late at night with the ghosts of the plentiful and the skeletons of pain. Till my hands ache, I will try to catch the rain. You will master intuition like a gypsy. You will bargain for enlightenment and flight. While the Liberace cops dream up ways to choke the air, you will ride on magic carpets with care. And you ain't never gonna be no seventh string. You ain't never gonna be no seventh string. And when blueprints for corruption have grown stale And a breath mint ain't no quick fix for your secrets And dollars follow question marks And question marks follow everything And the darkness doesn't know what night will bring Well, you ain't never gonna be no seventh string No, you ain't never gonna be no seventh string now if I'm acting low and I'm seeming out of range I hope the melody doesn't seem too strange I'm cutting corners, coke, running for the hills And life is just a testament written out of wills You're a maid and an I'm an old maid And all the lengthy conversations won't turn to slippers gold, babe The baby's gotta eat, the food it must be stable And life inside a garden seems like a fading fable Where's the collar and the dog holds the leash And the driveways are caught speeding and the parking lots are streets And a TV is a best friend and a book's the enemy You will always be the only one I read No, you ain't never gonna be no seventh string No, you ain't never gonna be no seventh string no, you ain't never gonna be no seventh string. No, you ain't never gonna be no seventh string. Today is a day of, um, I don't know. I had a really weird, long, tired day. Did you? Me too, yeah. Yeah. It can feel that way. Um, and this morning, because I look at Facebook in the morning, uh, sometimes somebody posts something like, uh, Bob Dylan would have been, a, if he could do it all again, he'd be a school teacher. And today, I wanted to call up Bob Dylan and tell him that was probably a bad idea. <laughs> I wrote 11 songs in my hand and I circled five of them. I haven't played any of the ones that I circled. <laughs> is JJ here or is he going? He's here, he's around. Okay. Well, he's going to miss the song that he asked me to play. Oh! That's the trick to you. <laughs> Thanks. It's funny because it looks like it's switched and then you look, it's not switched. I need a capo. Where's my capo? Sorry, I'm not prepared. Well, I am prepared, I just don't have my capo. Those are very different things. Now I have my capo and I'm prepared. 
but that doesn't mean it's going to. That doesn't mean anything uh, good is going to happen. He's coming. Um, JJ asked me for to play this song. It's called the breakup song for Brooke Pride Morrison. I have an anxious heart, but I keep on tagging these walls. Keep singing songs, sometimes even answer your calls. I'm hooked on you, it's true. Like a too big bottle of too strong booze, your love sure takes a bite. Now I'm letting you go, cause you're holding on too tight. I wonder, and I wonder how you keep on stealing my thunder and excitement. Even though I'm almost 14 states away, your state of mind is kind. When we're close, but not when we're on opposite sides of the night. And so I'm letting you go, cause you're holding on too tight. I got a letter in my pocket that I keep forgetting to send. Is this a fight to the death? Is this the beginning or is this the beginning of the end? Me, I'm like my dad, keeping it close to the vest, trying to keep the peace wherever I may rest. Well, I guess you can keep the baby when we sever all our limbs and you can tell your friends on the gravy train how you fell for Jack or Jim. He's a lawyer. He adores you, plus the wandering minstrel wasn't so bright. I'm letting you go, cause you're holding on too tight. Now we drive across the plains tonight, and the dust dries my throat. I can't keep myself from hitting the bottle if it helps me hit the notes. And I can't cry on the phone when there's tears enough for two. And baby, they're all coming from you. You're on the Upper East Side turning into a yuppie. As you order a venti and you play with a puppy. Me, I'm down in Florence with a dozen punk rock girls. And it's probably wrong, but they know every song. And they dress like leatherettes. And they like to drink cassettes. And when I buy the cigarettes, they buy the light. again, except the pounding on the fence, and the neighbors, they're all strangers, and they had shitty parents, and the Labor Day euphoria has passed, and I am home again, alone again at last, whistling Dixie in the bathtub, I'm pounding on a glass, I have food to eat, and room to sleep, but nothing more than that, and still the concrete gray of Brooklyn wants a summer in the grass, I'm home again, alone again at last. These wounds would heal if they had medicine to take And I could slam the wall with my head One of us would break There is too much space in here for me to fill And I've lost all my momentum and my will And I've been mulling bad decisions Like the ones I never make And the sky is black tomorrow And it's overcast today And the time moves slow And my mind's way too fast I am home again, alone again at last Alright, are you ready? It goes yeah. like this Thanks, John. <laughs> you always know how to come through for a guy. <laughs> it's a quiet house again. 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 And I am home again, alone again at last. Alright, let's count. It's a quiet house again. It's a quiet house again. 
It's a quiet house again. It's a quiet house again. It's a quiet house again. It's a quiet house again, and I am home again, alone again at last. So there's six of them, in case you get confused. You'll be able to do it, because you'll know there's six, and if you come in on the second one, you'll know there are five more. It's a quiet house again. 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 It's a quiet house again, and I am home again, alone again at last. Now, after the sixth one, you say, I'm home again, alone again at last. Only if you want to. <laughs> it's not required. Um, but occasionally, I've convinced people that if they chose in that moment when they're on the fence to jump to the singing side, they tend to have a better time, at least for the next 12 seconds. <laughs> It's a quiet house again. It's a quiet house again. It's a quiet house Just listen to the room. You're doing it. Yep, that's it. You're, you're getting it. That's right. Here's the sixth one. Yep. And I am home again, alone again at last. Thanks. I wish it would rain. I would go and drown a rat. Yeah. I would tell the screaming children that they're not stuck where they're at But the bastards in the basements play but shots hot down below And all the sense that comes from reading turns to dirty pain filled snow And it's a quiet house again, except the pounding on the fence And the neighbors, they're teenagers and they're already parents And the spring will come and heaven's men will laugh And I am home again, alone again at last One more chance It's a quiet house again it's a quiet house again. 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 And I am home again, alone again at last. Thanks. Okay, I'm going to be over here now, Alex. <laughs> That's Alex. Is Alex over there? Yes. He's working me out. Working me out. I don't know. Do you want to find out? Um, the one that I can just switch mics because um, there's the whatever the mic two that you're thinking of was the one that um, that Pete used to introduce. People, I, I call people weird names when I don't know them very well. So so far I've called you Peter and Pete, and I'm pretty sure you go by Englewood. I think so. I'm not quite sure. Right. So when you decide, you let me know, and then we'll know each other a little bit better. Um, uh, Debbie Dalton asked for a song that I haven't played since I recorded it. Uh, maybe once. Mm. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm going to try and remember it as we go. That's what the Anti-Folk Fest is good for, remembering things as you go, like what people's names are who you met six years ago. Sorry to Rick Snyder, who I... Is it Snyder? Yeah. Snyder, okay. Yeah, I learned that again tonight. <laughs> Switch deep inside my head Hope that I'm not wishing for a Methodist magician Who wishes he were dead No, someone alive would be absolutely preferable Someone unexpected and totally acceptable Something totally right when I turn on the light There's a gloom in the dustbin There's a tear in the clouds And all the silver linings are all turning browns And the birds are all flying south And I can't believe what's coming dark and I can't see my hands I write page after page to a faraway land if I planned this then I'd be mad but I'm making it up so it ain't so bad and yeah I want to see you but I don't want to see you like I need to yeah I want to see you but I don't want to see you like I need to and I wonder why I was made to watch 
the parade when I should be up front, setting the pace in a dream of the day when I hold truth victorious, never feeling lazy, and the room holds more of us, never feeling lazy, and the room holds more of us. But sometimes I gotta fight just to turn on the light. Yeah, 
you I'm apologizing for how I upset you Now if I get to let you let me go Oh, you let me go One time, I was at the Sidewalk Cafe. I was in a band called the Happy Zealots. It was a Daniel Bernstein band. I was the piano player. We played all kinds of songs and we just played four chords over and over again. It was great. gonna go drop by and see what's happening and I saw that the happy zealots were playing and I called the bass player he's a buddy of mine and I said hey did you know there's a show tonight and he said oh and I said let's go to the show walking in, Dan was walking in. We didn't really have a problem being numerous Dans on the scene. We all shared the real estate really well. I walked in and I said, hey, um, I saw you're playing a show tonight, but I didn't know about it, so I'm not going to play it with you. And he said, yeah, I think I'm going to go in another direction. And I said, I said, cool, that's great, but if things are awkward between you and I, it's totally your fault. <laughs> Which influenced the next part of this song. <laughs> don't say it's my fault if things are strange between us, and don't say it's my fault if things are strange between us, and don't say it's my fault if things are strange between us, and don't say it's my fault if things are strange between us, and don't say it's my fault if things are strange between us and don't say it's my fault if things are strange between us and don't say it's my fault if things are strange between us and don't say it's my fault if things are strange between you gonna let me go oh you let me go you're gonna let me go yo you let me go go on and do it Whether I'll forget you I'm apologizing for how I upset you Now when you get to heaven Let me go Oh, you let me go Over and over Oh, you let me go Oh, you let me go yeah. Ladies and gentlemen you are listening to Dan Costello. He's not done. We're going to let him go for two more songs. I'm going to come around with a tip jar for Dan. Suggested donation is five bucks per set. This is how we pay our fantastic artists at the Sidewalk Cafe. Get a couple bucks ready. Put your hands together one more time for Dan Costello. Hey, and thanks to, to Alex P. It's the, uh, the Nick Nasa I heard. And, um, and also Rob Schmuel when you did the cool reggae thing for him. You know, it was very, very clear at that point that you um, are doing the best sound at Sidewalk tonight. So give it up yeah. for Alex. Yeah. No competition among sound guys. We are a brotherhood. Sound dogs. Secret
and her husband, we are partners. So anyone who is offended by um, people saying that they, uh, they are someone else's something, uh, we are partners. And she is mine and I am hers, and we said that the day that we got married. And I think we said it a long time before that, too. Uh, we just made it official one day. Anyway, this is a song from the Bushwick Book Club. Um, I wrote... Right after we got married, Rachel took a, a month-long trip to India. It was a nice way to celebrate our wedding. <laughs> and um, it had been planned well in advance. And, and to be honest, she was going for two reasons. One was to uh, have all of her mercury fillings replaced really inexpensively by a perfectly adequate dentist. Even a good one. Except in India, it's a lot cheaper. And you end up, by paying kind of a pittance for dental bills in India, you end up enabling uh, an entire village to have a really great dentist the rest of the year. And enough people do it, then a lot of people have better teeth. Uh, that's the truth, but I don't know whether that actually mattered to anybody, but that's kind of the way it ends up. Uh, she also went to do some um, yoga. I stayed home and read a Vladimir Nabokov book called Despair. Uh, which is not the origin of the unreliable narrator, but I have to tell you in case you read this book that the narrator is lying to you. And you find out somewhere in the middle that he's been lying to you and he's not actually um, any good. <coughs> and he's a bad person and he does terrible things and you start to wonder like whether this book was really worth uh, reading in the first place. <laughs> and then you write this song which is half about me turning into my father and half about um, Dostoevsky. <laughs> So I'm gonna try. There's a lot of things that go that way. Sometimes I get a mirror, sometimes I get it wrong. Sometimes I write a poem, sometimes I write a song. Sometimes I write a story where no one has to die. Sometimes I don't know why. Sometimes I get an inkling, sometimes I don't know what. Sometimes I get a feeling, sometimes I'm chicken butt Sometimes I'm recognition, sometimes I see the lines Sometimes I feel no anger, sometimes I cheat the rhymes Dostoyevsky 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 I'm going out of my brain, I'm going out of my Sometimes I do not demonstrate Sometimes I find myself a bit unapproachable Sometimes I get attention Sometimes I do not mention The things I do when I have run out of time But I look in the mirror It is growing And it is distorted And I am in the circus And I'm the bearded lady I'm for 25 cents And I did not ask for this but I did not take the risk Dostoyevsky 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 I'm going out of my brain I'm going out of my brain Is it the end or is it the beginning? I am writing but I haven't finished reading This happens way too often Sitting in a coffin, I get the sense that I might actually be becoming Sometimes I get things my way Sometimes that's pure delight Sometimes I hit a bum note Sometimes I sulk at night Sometimes 
I seek reflection on all I haven't done. Sometimes I Insect. Sometimes I am the slap, sometimes I am the bear paw, sometimes I am the trap, sometimes I'm occupation, sometimes I'm unemployed, sometimes I'm peaceful easy, sometimes I'm paranoid, and I look in the mirror, have I become my father, someone unimportant, or maybe someone great, maybe numb from pain, maybe numb from pain, I'm going out of my somewhere in there. Hi, bye. Hi, bye. See you later. Good to see you. you uh, I feel this way every day, and some days I get to, and some days I don't. Ledger found dead in Soho. I'm on a train to Toronto. I saw him in a movie last month, playing one seventh of my hero. His part I never wanted. He had a troubling relationship. He had visitation rights. That's ugly any way you slice it. Bum 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 ba da dum bum 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 ba da 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 dum bum. Still wanna be a singer, and I wouldn't mind some kind of celebrity. But I don't know how a person does that, and I don't know if it really suits me. Bum 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 ba da da bum 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 ba da 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 bum. I have no choice but to be myself. Fake wizards have shown their faces. They'd move to the Hollywood Hills, the Louisiana Bayou, and Saratoga races. I don't want to die with poison. I don't want to be Bobby D or Mel Torme. I want to be Allen Ginsberg, but instead I howl who's to blame. The president's to blame. And David is to blame. My parents are to blame, no I don't want to die with poison Boil over like a short pot of pasta I want to be like Albert Einstein Be respected cause I use my noodle Relatively speaking You know what I mean Some people don't show their cards And that adds to their level of mystique But I don't think that would do me any good and I don't want to hide, I think it's weak, no I don't want to die with poison I don't want to be Bobby D or Mel Torme I just want to write my songs, yeah I just want to play music on the stage By the way, I love my parents David too I'm not sure about the president But he wasn't the president when I wrote the song 
I just wanna play music on a stage. Good night. Ladies and gentlemen, Dan Castello. Continuing the Winter Handy Folk Fest, night seven, and it does not stop.